New games come to the mobile market all of the time, but not all of them are worth your time to play. Today I have 10 new games that dropped on the mobile market that are actually a lot of fun. There are different genres, a good variety here, and all, in my opinion, worth your time trying. What I need you guys to do inside the video is let me know in the comments section which one of the games that I mentioned here today is your favorite. Let's get into my first recommendation. Coming in at number one is Rabbi Man Adventures. And as you can see, we're looking at a platformer style game. This one only has 50 downloads, being extremely new to the market. And it is a premium title with a $3.50 price tag at this point in time. As you can see, you're a child that jumps into your computer into a world of adventure with many exciting things ahead of you. It's a cool looking platformer and I like it for multiple reasons. One, I think the artwork style is really on point and looks really good. But in addition to that, I like how the perspective inside of the game changes. You're not just doing a, a side-scrolling adventure. You go into the screen in more of a 3D type realm, really enhancing what gameplay looks like. Obviously, cosmetic changes can be added to the game as well, which is quite nice, and the challenges change as you go from level to level. Definitely a solid platformer style game if you're looking for a new one and if you're an enthusiast. Welcome to a land, a land where I find myself residing daily. This land is Raid Shadow Legends and it's one that I want you to join me inside of to bask in the glory and in the joy that we encounter every single day. I legit love playing this game and I think that you guys would too. I'm gonna leave a QR code on the top of the screen for the entire segment of this video and there's a link in the description that gets you Fane as soon as you use it and once you reach level 15 it gets you Tyrell who was epic in the beginning of my account plus a whole bunch of other rewards that make you an all-star from day one. In addition to that it supports my channel so thank you and I want to thank Raid Shadow Legends for sponsoring today's video. Now, in addition to all the rewards that you get from using my code two epic champions you also right now can get one of the best arena champions in the game a legendary champion called well i like to call him the monkey king but his actual name is sun wukong and this is a guy that i missed out on when i started playing raid and i still regret it to this day all you have to do once you download the game with my qr code is use code monkey king and you get them absolutely for free. That's three champions you get for free that you can utilize throughout the game on day one from that QR code and that link in the description. Now, if you don't know who the Monkey King is, let me explain. This guy is a popular character from Chinese mythology, known for superhuman abilities, trickery, and intelligence. He's also central to the classic Chinese novel, Journey to the West. For any of you guys that are into that mythology and reading type stuff. And if you're not, it's cool. He kicks butt inside of the game. And on top of all those great rewards, plus a great game that has great community and a ton of fun, you guys can come join me over in my clan because I got a deadbeat in there. I got a kick out, which means it's a spot for you. My clan is Echo Raid, and I'd love it if you've joined me. Again, I want to thank Raid Shadow Legends for sponsoring today's video and urge all of you that have the desire to play to use my QR code or link down below and join me in Raid shadow legends next up we have grand saga this is a game that only has 10,000 downloads so another very new one to the scene and that is a role-playing style game it's an anime style game as well and as you can tell this is a very emotional experience that you'll have when you're going through the gameplay if you're someone that likes lore and if you're someone that likes diving into different realms in an anime universe this is something that very well may interest you. The game looks incredible. Graphic design here is premium, and it definitely has a Zelda-like vibe to it with a very different flair at the same point in time. I personally like this one, and I think that it has potential to do really well. All right, let's take a look at Total War Empire. This is a turn-based strategy style game that, again, is a premium title that you can pre-register for right now. It has a price tag of $20 for this game but takes you back into medieval-ish times and takes you into battle scenes that are actually quite unique and that do just feel and look different from other old-style games. Now, 
As you could tell, the graphics are not as premium quality as you'll get from some other titles, but also the gameplay is quite different. It makes you feel like you're diving back in history. And as you just saw, this one is releasing on the 21st of November, so you should have this one in your app store in approximately 9 or 10 days. Next up, we have Delivery Z. This is a driving style MMO game. Essentially, it's a goofy zombie style racing game that only has 5,000 downloads, a very new title to the scene. And as you can tell, it has a different vibe. It definitely has a mixture of some of those really cheesy games that you can download that you really don't understand why who, anyone plays them with a zombie style experience. It actually looks like it has some really addicting abilities to it as well. This is one that I would recommend you play if you're looking for a time killer, something that can just waste 10 to 15 minutes throughout the day when you're looking for something kind of cute and fun to play. Vinland Tales Viking Survival. This is a game you could pre-register for right now. And this is a strategy action RPG style game with sandbox game mechanics and big village building possibilities. You'll experience a new type of survival game with quests, continuous open world progression, frosty surprises in dark winter, and opportunities to raid until the Armageddon comes knocking. What I like most about this one is the sandbox element that's gonna bring a lot of customization to the players themselves, and I'm really looking forward to see how this one can build over time. Grid Legends is another racing style game that you guys can have and actually pre-register for right now. The graphics in this one look really cool. It takes you to the streets in a legit racing style game, another racing option for you. Super City Con, it's one of those tycoon style games it's a city builder and it kind of looks like a farm simulation style game i actually really like the graphics inside of this one lending itself to a casual gameplay style this game also has only 1000 downloads letting you know that you can get in on something very early before it bumps up in popularity you know that people love these types of coon games i think this one is a real great time killer when you need to just mindlessly dive into something for a little bit of a grind that's casual yet fun this is a great opportunity to do just that. But if you're looking to get into things a little bit more serious and a little bit more brutal, you have MWT Tank Battles. This is an action shooter vehicle combat style game where obviously you're playing as a tank. This one has a few more downloads as well with over 500,000 and really does look cool. I like the open world combat style feel that you get here. Now, I'm not particularly a person that likes vehicle style combat games, but I know I'm in the minority here and there are a lot of people that really do like that style of gameplay. If you're one of those, I think that this one does it well, giving you a lot of different options for vehicles to compete within and some PVE and PVP elements that actually seem like they are quite a bit of fun and competitive. Graphics are pretty on point as well. I think this is one that a lot of people are gonna play and a lot of people are gonna like. And then we have Nightfall. This is awesome because it's a strategy tower defense style game. You guys know me, I love me some good tower defense. Also, it's a stylized type game as well with a graphic style that is a little bit minimalistic, super colorful, and just something that you could really vibe with and get into. I particularly like this game. It's another one with 500,000 downloads as well. Next on the list is Children of Morta, and this is a role-playing game that actually got on the top of the charts at number six in RPGs. As you can see, we're looking at a pixelated style gameplay and it's a hack and slash style game where you're going to be taking your way and making your way through hordes of enemies in procedurally generated dungeons caves and lands that lead the family with their flaws and virtues against forthcoming corruption definitely an older school style gameplay combat here but that has a lot of lore incorporated and that is also and originally available on other platforms outside of mobile it was popular there and we're hoping that the popularity is here as well this is a seven dollar premium title and has over five thousand downloads now i recently shared this one in my previous video for the top november games but i want to share it here again in case you missed that one because this is a horror style game called carry on that is now with 500,000 downloads and it actually looks really cool. You're going through as this being that has no actual shape and in a platformer style horror game, you have to just basically demolish all of the good around and let evil take over. 
Pretty cool concept. I actually like it quite a bit. And as we get to the end of the list, I have Drive CSX Car Crash Simulator for all you simulation fans. Again, I'm not one of those people, but this one actually looks pretty cool for the genre. This is one that already has 1 million downloads, so clearly a popular one. Graphics are pretty on point for simulation style games as well. If you want to stay up to date on all of the upcoming and best mobile games to play, make sure you subscribe to the channel. I appreciate you guys.